Hi, I'm Joanna Krupa for PETA. Today we're doing a shoot about the cruelty that goes on in wolf farms. The whole concept of the shoot is I'm a woman that's been abused. Having my face looking like this, like I've been beat up, and this poor little sheep in my hand that died because a wolf farm abuser sheared it to death, skinned it alive, beaten it, cut it open, and it looks like it's so real, and it's really what they go through. PETA educates me and opens my eyes to the situations that go on. Like, you guys are amazing when it comes to all the undercover investigations. I had no idea that people were so cruel. They beat these sheep in these wolf farms. Some of them, you know, get slammed, break their necks, millions of them each year. They end up dying. They're shearing the animals so quickly that they cut them open sometimes, then they sew them without any painkillers. We all know all the stuff on fur, these animals get skinned alive. Wool is just as cruel. Look at me. This is makeup. It's just like women getting abused and beaten. Same thing for animals, but at least a human being can ask for help, can call the police, can ask a family member, can ask a friend, please help me. An animal can't. And this is why I'm so for fighting for the animals because they don't have a voice. And the difference between an educated human being and an ignorant human being is once you know the facts, you do whatever you can to not support the cruelty. And there's so many amazing alternative places that have beautiful sweaters. I mean, I'm dying of heat right now. This is, I mean, look at this. This is such a beautiful sweater and it's cruelty free. It's not wool and it's, and it's beautiful and it's hot as heck. I'm like, I'm like burning up here. So it's perfect for the winter. So there's no reason for cruelty. It's all about education and having a heart. I think a lot of times people can hear things but unless they see the actual like videos that PETA presents or these amazing, shocking ads, people are like, eh, they go on with their lives. So I'm very proud to be here again for my fifth PETA ad, and I know it's going to kick some butt. For more ways to help animals, go to PETA.org.